Students are back in the classroom this week and the Anchorage School District is ready to kick off the school year. But this year, new changes are coming to the district from school hours to curriculum. Georgina Fernandez joins us live outside Bartlett High School with more details. Georgina, good morning. Good morning, Ariane, and happy first day of school to all our ASD families and staff. You know, pretty soon we're going to be seeing students and teachers pulling up here at Barlett High School as the school doesn't just kick off their first day of school, but also the fifth day of the year they are opened. And with a new year comes new changes. Now, ASD has adopted a new ELA curriculum, K-3. This comes after the state recently passed the Alaska Reads Act, which creates a statewide comprehensive K-3 reading policy to help improve reading levels. Results from the 21 to 2022 ASD state proficiency assessments shows that 75.1% of third graders in the district were not proficient in English and language arts. The new curriculum, the district says, would ensure that ASD schools are aligned with the state when it comes to ensuring it has a strong reading instruction in the classroom. Which is very important because our board goal on reading proficiency is around K-3 students. So this is a good strategic move and we hope that um, in tandem with professional learning communities will allow us to improve reading outcomes for students. The district says it still hasn't received the most recent test scores from the state, but it plans to use that new data to help construct the baseline for the five-year strategic goal. And ASD says it's going to have screenings throughout the year, so every month or so they can keep updated to see how students are progressing. And Georgina, a question for you. How can teachers start taking into account that data uh, early on? Yeah, Arion, on those PLC monies, those professional learning communities, teachers are going to be able to look at that data in real time and see if they need to adjust anything they're doing in the classroom. And also the district says the board will be meeting monthly to review those goals. Arion. All right, Georgina, thanks so much. Also a reminder, next Monday, that is August 21st, is Late Start Monday. So once a week, on Mondays only, all schools across the Anchorage School District will start one hour later. Now, the biggest change will be for elementary and middle school students this year, as high schools already have been doing the late start. Teachers are excited about the change as it gives them time to meet and talk about student progress, as you heard from Georgina. And this year, the district is expecting its largest student population with 19,530 students attending school in the district.